Twitter, all of his Twitter. They thought they was gonna see the Marth. No, good. He was like, you know what? Right you want me to play mid tier? No, 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 no. I got the wolf. I got this laser. I'm gonna make sure any Gordo that come right at me is gone. <laughs> hey man, I thought you said we still had time for mid tiers out here, but we'll see what MK11 can mean, do about that. Not, not if you're trying to win. <laughs> yeah, that's true, man. When, when it comes down to brass tacks, you just want the money in the bank. Laser not finding the Gordo, but nonetheless, Leo just running back, trying to control the stage, and he is doing just that up throw, leading into that forwarder, and he has Muskrat just stuck here at the ledge. I do like the fact that Muskrat was able to respect the shine, and he actually was going to go for the inhale right after to catch MK Leo off guard. Solid setup to understand how your opponent might be reflecting your Gordos. But if you spend too much time trying to come back on the stage, it will catch up to you. He charges that down smash, the claws will not reach just yet. Back throw, still not going to take it. DDD is a very heavy character. Neutral air, still not enough, but you have Muskrat sitting at 162. One thing that I already see from Leo is that whenever the Gordo is out, he is ready for it. Whether it be with that reflector or when uh, Muskrat is actually absorbing it with his inhale, he's waiting for the inhale to come out, then tossing out the laser to shoot it back. All right, a little too overzealous with that down turn. That cost Muskrat a little bit more than the neutral here. Da da two dash attacks already, 53%. Leo just putting on all the pressure. Here come the forward airs. Muskrat yet again with the Gordo setup, and he immediately covers it up as soon as he sees the opportunity here, but it missed its mark. I respect the fact that he knows, hey, I got to cover Gordo as well. He might be reflecting it. He might be sending it back to me. But you're taking a lot for such a setup here. Nuchalera calling out that jump. Oh, but Leo finally getting hit by that Gordo back air, still off the mark. Oh. And Muskrat is just trying to make some things happen. Unfortunately, catching that spot dodge forward smash. Yeah, you, ca you caught him on the defensive side here. There's the forward smash once again, paying the price for such a setup there. And MK Leo is going to take this man to the other side of the stage. Muskrat finally breaks fear. There's the Gordo finally fighting MK Leo and even taking that stock as well. Okay, you get, you get to break your stick real quick. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, this is a stick check. You, you got the stop it, right. It's, it's an intimidation yourself. factor. It's like, Leo, you might be winning, but can you do this? <laughs> do you have the time to stop in neutral and do this? Oh, there's a solid setup here. It's not going to be Zaki, but definitely finds himself one inch closer to possible victory. It'll be fine. I mean, Muskrat is, you know, looking a, quite cleaner aside from that first stop. Um, really just challenging Leo a lot more as he was, as opposed to what he was doing in that first stop. He's stuck here at the ledge, coming up with that Gordo, but able to put up that shield inhale. Not quite going to get him, but it did push Leo off stage, so Leo couldn't advance his approach. Oh, watch yourself, Leo. You're looking a little too cocky, Leo, trying to go for that nair on the landing. That, ups, that forward smash <laughs> may have missed, but definitely Muskrat yet again feeling a little bit himself here. There goes the forward tilt one more time, laser. Just knocking Muscat right there, but that up smash, so much range, scoop him up, take that stock. Yeah, man, it's gonna be able to cover it, and not only the neutral get up, but roll get up. And unfortunately, if Muscat does time himself wrong on the landing, the jump get up as well, if he tries to align with an aerial. MKLeo pretty much covering three of the five options from the ledge. Pretty good option there, but Muscat not too far behind. Uh, I mean, it looks like he was checking the stick, and I'm not gonna lie, if he checked the stick right, he found himself at the last stock with MKLeo. Yo, at least he knows his, his dashes are going to be clean. It could be Chris. I can oh, move yeah. on a dime regardless of the direction I want to go. And on the pro controller? Man, you know what they say about pro controllers these days. <laughs> All right, well, MKL going to play a little bit on the safer side. Starts up with a blaster, earning himself 8%. Oh spot dodge. Here's my punish. Oh, wow. He actually just landed straight up. It was surprising. Uh, the last times that Leo got that down throw into the dash attack, it actually put Mus Muskrat into a tech situation. Back air, not gonna do it, but Leo again, reminiscent of game one, putting on all this pressure, all this percent. Oh wow, actually getting away from that neutral layer attempt. Muskrat just tossing out these hitboxes, and again, Leo calling out the spot dodge with a forward smash. All right, well, there's that forward tilt immediately getting rid of Muskrat. Muskrat comes back with the Gordo. One thing I'm noticing about Resident Evil here is that he loves going for the setups, right? And it's been earlier in game one where some of the setups do pay off, but he goes so much into them, right? A uh, setup here, but MKLeo is nowhere near the side where that, even if that Gordo was smacked around, it was going to be on the left side, not the right side of MKLeo. It's a fake out jump. Oh my yeah. goodness, Leo <laughs> showing him he could do the same exact thing. I love it. We have movement out here, man. We have movement. 
some people will say uh, we're schmoovin'. Yeah. All right, no laser <laughs> coming out. Leo just trying to run up there, get a forward air, possible grab. Oh. Not going to be the case. That's a quick punish there. Oh. Put this man Ooh, in the down. down. He just wanted the stock. Yeah, he did. He just wanted the stock. I respect it. You're still up by one. Why not? Yeah. Down throw. Here's the dash attack. Kind of like the new bouncy fish down. Th <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Wolf, Wolf is just furry chic. Yeah. Oh, Super that's a heavy. That. That, that's a big boy. Yeah, Leo, Leo getting clipped by the stars at the tail end of that. Oh, we canceled it, but it doesn't matter where you go. Muskrat eating that down smash. Leo winning with a 2-0 victory. I mean, 